Thank you, everybody. Thank you, everybody. Please sit down. Thank you. This is such an amazing honor. And the difference is we want to all get back to work, whether it's building our military or building our country. We have to get back to work. We have a lot of work to do. We've been very much left behind. Uh, speaking with the admirals and the generals and all of the military people, we talk about the word depletion. Uh, the military has been so badly treated in terms of its equipment and the money being spent. And this is a time where we need our military perhaps more than ever. When you look at the number of ships, you look at the number of military personnel, you look at the numbers are setting records for all-time lows. We can't have that. There's a world out there, and it's not nice to say, but there are a lot of very, very evil people heading up some potentially very strong countries. We have to be prepared. We have to keep our country so great and so strong. And that's why to have all of the support from so many generals, so, so many admirals, people I respect so much, uh, they're smart, they're tough, they know what's happening. And I believe in them totally. And that's why the fact that they believe in me is one of the great honors of my life. So I want to thank everybody. Thank you. Now, not to mention her in the same breath, but Hillary Clinton and her campaign of 2008 started the birther controversy. I finished it. I finished it. You know what I mean. President Barack Obama was born in the United States, period. Now we all want to get back to making America strong and great again. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you, everybody. Thank you.